Now, what we are understanding is that the Union Home Minister Amit Shah is currently meeting the Lok Sabha Speaker as far as the ongoing impasse in Parliament is concerned. Remember, there is complete breakdown of trust communication between the government and the opposition. Suspensions continued even today. Unprecedented numbers, numbers that we've never seen in the past. And as we've been pointing out, that the government is saying that this was a fair opportunity for the opposition to raise their concerns, but they just didn't want to use the opportunity. In fact, they only only wanted to resort to hangama and ruckus. Let's go straight to our colleague Pyle, who's joining us on the broadcast. Pyle, talk to us about who else is in the meeting. Uh, well, uh, the Union Home Minister, Mr. Amit Shah, is currently meeting the Lok Sabha Speaker along with him is Parliamentary Affairs Minister Pralad Joshi and the leader of the House in the Rajya Sabha, Piyush Goyal. All of these three leaders are meeting the Lok Sabha uh, Speaker right now because it seems that the pandemonium is just not going to end in Lok Sabha. Several MPs have been suspended so far. Uh, in fact, maximum of the opposition MPs have been suspended so far. Uh, just about 40 of the Indian Alliance still left to be suspended. You know, that's the joke that is going on in Parliament. Saying, you know, Abhi kitne bache hai? that's the question that is being asked as well. But the MPs are saying that, you know, their voices are being muzzled. At the same time, the government has made an appeal to them saying important legislation needs, needs to be passed. And the Home Minister himself has appealed to the people saying that, you know, it's a very, very crucial set of legislation, which is the three criminal bills which, uh, which needed to be discussed, for which Parliament had allocated about 15 hours of time. But it seems that the discussion is going to be... Uh, going to be a bit of a futile exercise right now given the fact that most of the opposition MPs are currently out and among the Congress party which is the single largest party only Rahul Gandhi and Sonia Gandhi possibly are two leaders who are left in the parliament still. So obviously uh, looking at the situation of over there and with the opposition continuing to mount its uh, attack on the government uh, it is of course a very important meeting because we'll have to just wait and see when the home minister replies to the debate despite the fact that there has been 15 hours which been allocated for the bill it's only likely that tomorrow the home minister will reply he will not speak during the introduction during the bill because he's already introduced the bill in the last session of parliament. But in the reply, he's expected to give an elaborate response uh, to the bill. And of course, uh, all the arguments that have come to the fore with the government bringing a new bill, plenty, plenty of amendments being incorporated. Okay, Pyle, we'll have to leave that conversation there. Thanks a lot for getting us those details.